mosquito ever buzzed close to your ear? Or have you ever noticed the sound flies make? They make these sounds by moving their wings back and forth. In fact, sound comes from things moving back and forth or vibrating. Vibration is a back and forth motion. Your mother calls you from downstairs and she sounds concerned. Although you do not see her face, her voice is very stern. You're sleeping but you hear the radio start to quietly play. You know it's morning so you rise to get ready for the day. Sound is what you hear, it's something you don't see. But different sounds help us to identify most things. Sound is what you hear. thrown a pebble in a lake? Did you notice the ripples the pebble made? The ripples are water waves spread out from where you threw the pebble, just like sound waves do from vibrating objects. Air ripples are sound waves spread out from things that vibrate and set our eardrums vibrating too. Will the earth get too crowded when we need another plan? Is pollution a problem on our precious land? Is outer space the answer? Can we live in colonies? And build a home for everyone to live in harmony? Is gravity a problem if new homes we pursue? Those scientists would need to know just how this would be done To live in space colonies I think would be great fun
many different artificial satellites today. Weather satellites help us learn more about the weather. Navigational satellites help different types of aircraft and ships to navigate about the Earth. Scientific satellites help us learn more about our solar system and Earth, while communication satellites enable people to see and talk to each other from all over the world. A satellite will travel in a special path. This path is called its orbit. The Earth orbits the sun. 